And we're live. Hi, Shell. Let's see what's waiting for us. Hi, Danny. She beat us in. She did. She was waiting. Must be we're lagging. No, we just didn't click the live, but it was showing up probably. Brian and James are here. <laughs> Brian says, I am here. Go. <laughs> Everybody hear us okay? Hi, Kim. And Antoinette and Jen. Or Annette, sorry. Violet is here. Hey, hey, hey. What are you doing? Just Kim saying it. Oh. <laughs> He's got one too many. He's being silly. Oh, it was you. You had your button muted, huh, Shell? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hope everybody's feeling good. Oh, I see a fly in here. He's flying around. Mm -hmm. Alan's firing up his fire. <laughs> fire, fire, fire. Let's see if I can draw in some more people tonight, too. Oh. You're silly. Hi, Shirley. Yes, we all need to have our souls soothed tonight, for sure. <laughs> she said, Beavis is back. <laughs> she said, fire, fire, fire. <laughs> Somebody call me a Beavis? Well, it's better than butthead. <laughs> All right, hon. Show last week's paintings. Do I have to? Yeah. My first one was the red one. Ew. I told you I, you weren't going to like it dry. I do like the red, the red violet in there though. It's pretty. We'll we'll save that one for Nate to play with when he comes. And we're gonna start a third box for him. You mean a fifth? <laughs> I already have four. Good thing he's coming from two weeks. He might need to make that a month. We didn't touch him last time he was here. Hi, Joanne. Joanne, I'll show you your um, painting in a little bit here. I Took it out of the resin coffin today. Looks beautiful. Coffin. It's bad everywhere, Shirley. Okay, so then you did... Did that one. This beauty. Yeah. I actually love that with the coral and the, um, what is that, orange yellow. Mm -hmm. I like it. Maria's here. You better get cracking on your uh, varnishing here. I know. I think I have probably 70 to varnish right now. That's why I've been resonating because I can do five at a time. So this one. Oh, I'm sorry, Catherine. I know how you feel, honey. This really slid off the canvas quite a bit as it was drying, which I still like it, though. I still think it's very pretty. 
Thanks, Sherry. This was done with the Healthy Choice steamer tray. I like that one. And we got a few tiles from that. A little excess paint. And this one, I don't know how. What and happened? Yet you pulled that dark spot. <laughs> That's all right. We have lots of singles. So that's that's a set of four. It doesn't it's, it's match. The, it's the ugly duckling. <laughs> One of these things is not like the others. <laughs> and then the last. So I wanted to use up that green earth. But I'm so glad that the purple played a part and didn't um, get lost. And the gold is there, too. There's a lot of metallics in this painting, guys. He's having a hard time getting the uh, sheen. He just tips it forward. You'll just see all the sheen. Tip it forward. See it all? That's all metallic. So I was happy with the way it dried. So that's a keeper. I'm not going to pour over it. I was worried last week that I, I was like, ugh. <laughs> that's true, Susan. <laughs> Racks are full. Yes, they are. I don't think we have any empty spaces either. Nope. Which means I need to get my butt to work. Um, chop, chop. Just want to show Joanne her painting real quick. Okay. Joanne, I'm going to mail this out probably Thursday or Friday. So she's all resined. She's all pretty, pretty. Lots of interference color in there. I'm very happy with it. So we will get that out in the mail. Sue Jonathan says, wowza. Yeah, I gotta do some more of these. I have to do more because everybody wants to buy them. I don't know where I'm gonna put them. Hey, Marcy. So, Thank you. <laughs> I was told, don't show my legs tonight. Oh, he's got shorts on. <laughs> I'm having a hard time with the whole going from pants to shorts with him. Dress shirts to t-shirts. <laughs> mm. <clears throat> And I'm still sick, guys, but I did start antibiotics, so hopefully I'll feel better by Wednesday. Marcy wants to see your legs. <laughs> Marcy, if you ever see a chicken run across the yard, oh that's Alan. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, boo, what you painting? Oh, what do you got? A diffuser. Diffuser. So the key to this diffuser is going to be the colors. Uh -huh. Do they have little holes in the bottom? Did we use that before and you said, oh, I don't ever want to clean that again? No, it wasn't this one. I think it was the other one. You probably there. threw the other one away. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. <love> this one. <laughs> they're both the same. No, they're not. Look the same on the bottom. 
Oh, oh, I actually like this one better. It's got a smaller flower in the middle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, use that one. So it's gadget time. Yeah, my chest is really super heavy. I know it's the change in the weather from coming from Arkansas to here. So <clears throat> I just have to get used to the weather again. And of course, it's really warm here. It wasn't that. It was about. 75 today yeah i had the door open all day it was gonna be like 90 on wednesday Ugh. yeah i don't think he sprayed it last time shell because i was afraid it would drip down onto the canvas before the paint did so that's a that's a good thing to know <laughs> colors 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 so the green thing is a, is a mirror, and that's how we keep the camera in focus. Because when we just have a canvas up there, it likes to go blurry. Shelly's cold. Oh, Shelly. <laughs> I was cold in Arkansas. Oh, but we slept like babies. We sure did. Need some lighter, lighter colors to complement. So yesterday, you keep pulling your colors. Go yesterday ahead. we um, we got our new furniture on Thursday. We didn't even touch it. So yesterday we uh, put the felt pads on and cleaned the wood floors and moved everything around. And I'll tell you what, I'm sure is not. I'm not forty anymore. <laughs> I have no energy to do that kind of stuff and I have to paint that living room yet. Ugh. You sure you're not 40? No, I'm not Something. 40. Mm -mm. Are you sure? Hi, Lorena. Yeah, I just, uh, I don't have the energy to do that stuff anymore. And Shelly and Maria know how bad my studio is right now because I did cave and send them a video. <laughs> that you did not make public. I didn't want anyone to, to not believe me when I say my studio's a mess. We have all the retreat stuff out here now. Did not get our bed yet. It's on its way. So that'll be the next room we have to tear apart. I sleep fine, Linda. I don't have any trouble sleeping. I just, I stay up late. But I sleep late. Too late. Yeah, I do stay up pretty late. But I'm usually up before noon. <laughs> it's an artist life. You stay up late and get up late. Yes, my studio is loaded. I have eight boxes of canvas sitting right here next to me that I don't know where I'm going to put them. Shelby. So next up. week, we're going to be... Um, Showing Brian's toys so you guys can see them up close instead of just a picture. I said don't spray it because it'll drip on the canvas. It's going to come out of those holes. Are you putting a base coat down? No. Can you just put a puddle now? Puddle? Of, of paint on the canvas? Sure. Maybe just squirt some white on there with no silicone. I can do that. Because I'm afraid that'll drip on the canvas and your paint won't stick. So what were you saying about Brian's gadgets? So Brian's going to send me his gadgets. We're going to show them next week. And um, it's easier if we show you what they look like instead of him just posting pictures. Okay. Color choices. Victoria's Muscadine Wine. Got to get my gloves on. We have one, Susan, and we actually have them. We have four other ones that are mounted to the walls up by the ceiling, but they're all full of other stuff like bubble wrap and boxes. And 
Premier Purple Red. One of the Parash Passi Bubblegum Shimmer. Hi, Mary Ellen. <laughs> Hope you're feeling better. Silver Lake Metallic. Welcome, Christy. See, Mary Ellen took my advice. What's that? She was looking for something to do that wouldn't involve a credit card. And I told her, come to Monday Night Live. Oh. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me that all weekend? Because I spent a lot of money this weekend. <laughs> and Beach Retreat Shimmer. There will be a UPS truck here probably every day for the next 10 days. <laughs> or FedEx, one or the other. <laughs> Mary Ellen, can I give you the credit card to hold for us for a while? <laughs> and then really lamp use, black. I didn't really use a credit silicone. card. <laughs> no, you use the debit card. I used the debit card. So canvas size 12 by 16. I put a little puddle of white in the center. Shelly said, send it to her. She'll take care of it. Can you go, watch that for us, Shelly? She'll go to TJ Maxx with it. <laughs> Mine too, Dina. We should exchange pictures. Maybe we'll feel better about each other. <laughs> okay. Not sure about this order, but... Now, this has a very large... Is that all open on the bottom? Can it I... is all open. Oh. I almost think I want to put it into a cup. Yeah, like a dirty pour. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to need a, a little extra paint, though, because... This should be enough, though. I wouldn't even go that far. I mean, go to the... Yeah. Because you don't want to have too much. Okay, so we're going to start off. This is going to be the last color out, so it's Victoria's Muscadine Wine. Here are the helicopters. Raleigh's on curfew, right? Raleigh is on curfew. Raleigh, North Carolina. Hi, Vic. We went on curfew, what, 8 o'clock today? 8 o'clock. Until 5 a.m. But isn't this a better way than... To spend your evening and watching the news. Yes, yes. Bubblegum shimmer. Oh, I'm sorry, Susan. I've been watching my friend Andrew. He's been filming every night. That's why I stay up so late, because he's usually on. The last night he was on until 6.30 this morning, but I didn't stay up that late. Silver Lake <laughs> Metallic. It is a horrible situation, but you need to hear them. Um, so you're using black in between? Mm -hmm. Okay. Carolina Blue Shimmer. We have all the paint orders that came in have been mailed out. I have a new one new paint order that came in before we went live, so I will take care of that after the live. And this last color again is the Beach Retreat Shimmer. I'm going to do one more round of that. I think this game of Jumanji should be over with pretty soon, shouldn't it? <laughs> We're in what, level five? Level six. It's a little more premier purple red. Whoops, almost screwed up. A little black. Uh, Joanna, you can get them either way. We have them pre-mixed, and you can get them with or without silicone, or we have them in jars. 
They're both the ago. same price. Silver Lake Metallic. Carolina Blue Shimmer. Brian, how much paint do I need? <laughs> A lot. <laughs> 12 by 16 canvas. I'm tempted to. I'm not going to do it, though. I was tempted to squirt a I little you, white Jen. right down the center. But we have the white down underneath this gadget. Are we ready? This is going to be a quick pour. The key for me is to make sure I get it in the center. Be dark. It's gonna be dark. A little. Just a tad. I am liking what it's coming out though. Ooh, I see color. I see what is that? Man, oh silver lake, that's what I see. Put a little white around the outside so that we get some flow. Why are you sad, Carrie? Because he got it dirty. <laughs> that infuser? Yeah. <laughs> All the hair dryers I buy that come with those, I've never used them. <laughs> I think the only time I ever used one was when I had a perm to keep it curly. Yeah, it's for a hair dryer, Bri. For curly girls. You got one big puddle of paint there. You got plenty of paint to tilt. Some of those bubbles. The canvas is pretty low this time. Yeah, I was monkeying around with that board in there yes, the other day. We need to put an MDF board in there, I think. And we won't have to worry about it. Oh, let the fun begin. Put a little more paint right around the Sounds like he's hovering over our house. Doesn't it? That's definitely, is that an army copter? Could be. Right, Linda? I prepped him a ton of canvases and he got a rectangle one. <laughs> Well, they're really loud. Our whole house is vibrating right now. We might have more than one out there. <laughs> Not around us, Terry, but downtown Rally, yeah. Although they did shut the, uh, they closed the Lewisburg um, Walmart. So that might be where they're coming from, it's Lewisburg. Oh, that's true. 
Yeah, we won't have that happen again. They know to call me next time. <laughs> and we know to answer. We know to answer, that's what I should say. Well, that's pretty bad when they have to shut the post office down. We're a small of America, Ellen. It's in Minneapolis. It is? Yeah. I wonder if they rioted there. That would have been really scary. No, they didn't close it, Sue? Yeah, I've been I've seen a lot of it in Minneapolis cuz Andrew's been walking the streets and filming. I really don't want to lose that left corner. You got a lot of paint on there. You're going to have to take some off. I know. Or it'll do what it did last week and run off. Set it down so I can see it. I like what you've got going there on that by that white corner, too. That little white thing there? No, the other corner. Over right. here? Yeah. I like yeah, but that's got to come off. I know. I know. Um, yes, we always use premix paint. I like the way that's opening up now, too, on the other corner. That's cool. I still have a lot of paint. I bet you that's in Lewisburg. That's just too close. I'm glad we're out in the country. <laughs> um, It's not dark right now, but it will be when it's dry. He does have a couple of metallics in there, so that'll keep, they'll stay light. don't like this tree figure there. I know, I see an angel too. <laughs> She's going to be very dark when she dries though, because that's that wine. Step away. 
away from the painting. I don't know if you guys can hear them, but they're like hovering in our area. I don't want it to get too loud. That's the... <clears throat> So looking at it this way, I'm looking at it the way you were looking at it before. Anybody see what this little guy is here? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Point that out again. This little thingy right here. And then there's one to the right of that that looks like mm -hmm. a praying mantis head. <laughs> Torch it and see what we get. Anything comes up from underneath. I tried to use equal parts paint, and the beach retreat kind of just faded off, except for a little up in here. Because it's heavy. That's more of a, a heavy opaque color. That's why, and it has a lot of iridescent in it, so it's got the tendency to sink. is how much excess paint do I have on there? I know what I'd call this painting. Mm -hmm. You're not going to smack me, are you? I hope not. <laughs> I'm going to call this conception. <laughs> what would you call it conception? <laughs> You're such a dork. <laughs> I'm going to leave this. Even though I do have a lot of paint on there. Yeah. Angel in red. Brian says, smack me. <laughs> he just wants violence. <laughs> okay, it's going to the drying rack. What was that noise? That's probably your puppy wanting to come out and join us. Oh. But I will go check. Scared me. Now, look at some of these potential skins. They're dark. Huh? Yeah, but look in here. Oh, I'll pull that and put it on tile for you. Over in here. I want to just show them this real quick. That's our new rug for our living room. So we got one that looks like a paint pour. So now I have to make all new paintings for my living room because everything in my living room is teal and brown. So this is going to be gray and blue. So that'll be fun. <sighs> I just got paint on me, and I didn't even come near here yet. <laughs> Give me my apron. <laughs> yeah, put an apron on, Missy. <sighs> All right, let me pull that. Yes, I know. Go ahead, yell at me. I'm not yelling at you. You were going to. Mm -mm. I'm used to it now because it's there every Monday. <sighs> I did do my bottle cleaning services. He did. He was out here a long time. And he just ran the door into the dog. <laughs> I got enough paint on here or not. Hi, Eddie. Daddy's kicking you out, isn't he?
pretty. He's like, ha ha, I came out. I'm not leaving, ha ha. <laughs> yeah. You know what he wants? He wants his vitamin. Yep. It's pretty bad when your dog looks forward to his vitamin every night. Vitamins. Um, I think they're chicken flavored. We make um, homemade dog food, so besides the uh, crushed eggs in the dog food, I still give them a multivitamin. But he loves that dog food. It's like meatloaf. That one's kind of dark. Okay, last one. Mm, I don't want to go too dark. I'm coming. Thanks for the warning. Are they bacon flavored, Linda Wentz? No, I told them they're chicken. I'm eating my vitamins too. How are you? I like that corner. Hmm? I like that corner on that one. Time for me to clean up my mess now. Um, did you bring a bucket out? Mm-hmm. Have fun cleaning that. That you might want to do tonight. Maybe. I like how you say maybe. She's not busy. Don't let her fool you. Who? Me? Yeah. I'm always busy. Get in there. Alan's not here all day. He doesn't know how busy I am. Linda knows me so well. All right. Thanks, Puddin. So I want to do, um, Kind of a tester painting for like a color swatch for the living room. Now all she come do is some experimenting. Experiment. Brian says you just sit around and watch Dr. Phil. I do not <laughs> watch Fox News. <laughs> 
Actually, I don't really watch a lot of TV during the day. It's all at night. Christy Klein says, wow, gorgeous. I want to try to make pendants with the overflow, but not sure how without getting it all over the outside. What, and dipping them? Is that what you're talking about? We dip them. We dip them where we put that on uh, photo paper. Instead of putting it on tile, we put it on photo paper. This is waterproof. And then you can glue your cab on that and cut it out. <clears throat> now, somebody was questioning about the cork. Oh, yeah, we got our cork roll, guys. I know we showed it last week, but uh, somebody was asking about it just a minute ago. So this is the roll of cork that we get. There's already. 500 on that. So if you make a lot of coasters, that's the way to buy it. It'll last you a year. I've had my first roll. Oh, my dad had my first roll for two years. All right. You know, Shell, you live close. You can always come and get some. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to try a little experiment. And Christy wants to know, where do you get the cork rolls? I get them from Etna Felt. A-E-T-N-A. -E I'm sure Maria or Shelly will post the Yeah, link. isn't it in Altoona? Altoona, Pennsylvania? Yeah, because we always ride by it. I'm like, that's where I get my felt. Or my cork. Shelly um, just doesn't want to. Shelly, if you ever come over here, and I'm sure you will someday, <laughs> you probably won't leave for a while. All right, let's try this. She said she ordered a small bowl. I should have ordered it with mine, and then she wouldn't have to pay any shipping. Not a lot of white left. I need to find those jugs that we took to Maria's. <laughs> Do you know where they're at? The jugs? I think I want a light gray. And then I'm going to put that silver lake in there. Yeah, they're in a box. I just don't... I saw them once, and then you brought all that other stuff out, and I didn't see them anymore. Okay. Okay, so these are pretty much the colors that are in that rug. It's more gray than blue. But I still want to play. So we're going to do one big dirty pour. Let me go with, let me do the Lucas Steel Blue next. This is like a denim blue. I like this color a lot. And then we'll go with some silver. Sue Jansen wants Nubless? Yes. Shelly got me tiles from a tile place that were nubless. I'll do some gray. Please, everybody, be safe. Stay home. Silver Lake Metallic. A little more silver. Do you that. see the joy she gets from that? <laughs> it's okay. When I when I uh, start filling jars this week, you're going to have a lot of jugs. Okay, I'm done with that one. I purposely pick colors so that... Um, you have jugs to wash. Let's see if I get a little more out of that one. 
you know, Maria, if we had gone a week later, we probably would still be out there with either you or Carrie. Yeah, we wouldn't be able to get home with the interstates being shut down. All right, I think we're good. So I don't want to, I don't think I want to ring pour this. I don't even know if I want to travel. Maybe we'll do a kind of a waterfall. Let's see what we get if I just waterfall it a little bit. And Amy Haggis says, Christina, my order of three Aussie flow trolls finally came in. It took over two months. Yeah, it does take a while, especially with everything that's going on. Oh, it's a lot of Silver Lake. Angela says she can't wait to get her paints, Christina. She loves them. I think I just saw a clump fall out of here. When did you mail? You did Angela's Friday, Thursday, Friday? Uh, Friday. She should get them tomorrow or Wednesday. Mail's not running too far behind now. I know I get my stuff quick. Kathy says the Amazon orders have been taking a long time. Yeah, they have been taking a little bit longer. The last stuff that I ordered the other day, though, it's here already, so it's getting better. So I'm going to bring this corner off so I can play with it. Yeah, that, that battle was calling my name, Jerry. I have a ton of blue on that end. I don't want to lose it all. A lot of white. My fault, too. I put a lot of white in the bottom of that cup. Hopefully some of it will sink. There's that clump. I see it now. It's you big. Clump? It's big. It's a big goober. Definitely going to change the look of the painting. Ah. Ooh. I can fix it a little bit. So that's the best tree ring for us you've seen. It's not a not really a tree ring with silicone in it. More of a I don't know. See how it's starting to sink though? I like when the white sinks, but not all the way. So then you get some really cool lacing. So why is Brian yelling booger? Because I pulled a booger out. Look at it. I can do that too. Look at <laughs> you actually. Maybe get, not that big. You could actually get, actually hear it hit. Joanne says that's going to look great with your new rug. We'll see because I don't even know what color gray it is until it comes, you know. So I have it's on its way. I got the shipping notice today. So once it's here, then I go in with all my swatches and say all right which one am i gonna do thank you shirley thank you shirley appreciate you honey let me torture so i may want to do these without silicone yeah 
Yes, now those reusable bottles that Shelly is referring to do not get washed by me when they're done. <laughs> we suggest having a bottle of John dish soap and a good bottle brush. And they should scrub pretty clean. Ooh, I kind of like that skin over there. Just pay attention to your <laughs> painting first. You get the skin later. Talk about that. It's pretty. So all this white looks like it's going to start sinking. Not all of it, but some of it. Because we're going to get some more lacing. Good night, Kathy. The shot says no deposit, no return, Alan. <laughs> oh, Linda, that's horrible. She had a dumb fly play hopscotch on her metallic ring for her today. Oh, uh, what was the one? I had a moth. I put my, it was when I didn't have a big enough pouring table. I stuck it on the floor to dry. Big mistake. Not as bad as the, uh, what do they call them, water roaches? That big thing I had out here. You want them? I got them. You still out here. Scared the crap out of me, you guys. Night, Angela. I was um, on my computer. And I was watching the TV monitor above <laughs> my computer. And he come running across my laptop. I wish I had that. He was like camera. that big. I'm not kidding you. How big? That big. He wasn't. Yes, that he big. was. He was not. So I'm out here. And I'm like, Ellen. <laughs> El and I like try not to yell really loud, but loud enough that maybe he could hear me because the door was closed. So then I like backed up and went sneaking towards the door. I open the door. I'm like, Ellen, please come help me. And he comes like running because I never yell for him like that, you know. And uh, he tried for a good five minutes to get him, but he got away. But he did find him. Hopefully it was him dead. <laughs> huh? Don't bring him over here. That's gross. <laughs> I just want to prove he wasn't that big. Well, that's probably not even the same one. See, he wasn't that big. Ew. <laughs> you know, it's enough that I have, I think I have one of those little lizards, you know, those summer lizards that run around. I think he lives under my bun rack because every day I'm out here and I can hear him on the parchment paper. That slid under the bun rack. So that I, at least I know when he's moving around. But it's fun painting in the garage, let me tell you. <laughs> Brian's even like, ew. Oh, I missed that <laughs> corner. He's <laughs> like, dude. Sorry, Brian, I didn't need to grow out. All right. I'm going to get one more. I want to get one out of that. I used a glove. Puddle over there. It wasn't a dead animal. It was a dead insect. <laughs> I grew up on a farm, Brian, so I touched a lot worse. <laughs> yes, he has. Give me another time. Might as well give me two because there's enough here for me to pull two. And I'll have a set. I need a little bit of blue for that, though. So I'm going to have to tape some more of these up. I got a whole case to tape yet. Yeah. See how that white opens up when I put it on there? <gasps> I hate that screech. So 
So that's one of the reasons that I have the covers for my bun racks. So I can put things in and zip them shut so nothing can get in there. But Thank you, Sue. I rarely see bugs out here. Appreciate your support. Thank you, Susan. So Christy wants to know, are there any previous lives available to watch? She's met I've got lives. lots of them. We, we have we've been doing it over almost, a year. Almost two years. Be, well, you started before I joined you. Yeah. So it probably has been two years. Yeah, probably. So there's one for every week. Okay, so Linda Brown's got a good question. How do you pick up that paint without getting fuzzies off the piddle pad? I don't have fuzzies on my piddle pad. Because my got is, the plastic side up. Yes. And Chrissy says, wow, I'll never get anything done. That's how I was when I first started. I used to watch Nikki Birch. And Ann Osborne. <sighs> um, kind of can't even think of names right now. Kim McDonald. You, there weren't a lot of lives, though. No, there weren't, a, weren't any lives back then. The one thing that we like about doing the lives is it gives you an opportunity. To have some input too. Right. Ask questions. I mean, because we're here not just to paint. We're here to also hopefully educate and also be educated. Yeah, we love when people offer us suggestions for stuff too, because it's like, I wouldn't have thought of that, you know? Hello, Molly. Hey, Mal. Como esta usted? I think these need to be put through the rock tumbler. All right. Now that I've made a mess. The chat says, yeah, I learned a man washes the bottles. <laughs> That's been explained before why he does that. <laughs> That allows me admittance to the parage. Oh, she's talking back to you. Who's talking back to you? Molly. I have no idea what she said. <laughs> I only took two years. <laughs> you got him, Mal. Je ne comprends pas. <laughs> oh, God, don't start with the French. Arrow is a dog. <laughs> well, at least you got him, Molly. He had no clue. <laughs> I could I could have spent a little time to trying to figure it out, but kind of like my painting and choosing colors. Um, Christy Maria, our moderator, has um, a cabin resort out in Eureka Springs, Arkansas. We were there two weeks ago filming. It's beautiful out there. Is it that long ago? Yeah, it's been that long. Well, over a week. Yeah. I miss it. Don't you miss it? I miss it. Yeah, we miss it, Maria. I miss Maria, too. Had, Mo Molly says she's tired, but don't worry. <laughs> I had I had fun feeding Maria. You had fun feeding Maria? And you. I cooked too. And Monica. <laughs> we ate a lot of squash and zucchini. We ate a lot of everything. Yeah, we did. You gained 10 pounds. I only gained three. Yeah, but I'd lost five. 
I've lost four. I lost one more than what I need. <laughs> I got a lot more to go. So it's time for a flip and drag. Um, Christy, if you're on just the first floor, yeah. Because she um, can seal off the downstairs. Yeah, I wasn't talking about my quarantine game, Molly. <laughs> I was just talking about vacation game. We won't talk about quarantine game because none of my summer clothes fit. I have to wear dresses all summer. Exactly. <laughs> Canvas size 12 by 16. For those of you that no, are. No, that's not. Huh? It's not a 12 by 16. I, 8 by 16. 8 by 20. 9 by 12. <laughs> Brian, why didn't you tell him what size canvas he had? Brian, what size canvas is this? <laughs> Sorry, I'm tired. I only got three hours sleep. Yeah, I've been saying that every weekend, Molly. I always tell Alan, don't bring me any tea because I'm going to start dieting on Monday. And then on Monday night, I'm like, would you bring me a tea tomorrow at lunchtime? <laughs> like tonight? <laughs> If you really love me, yeah, you bring you, me a if tea. If you really love me, you'll swing into McDonald's and get me a tea. <laughs> All right, Alan, paint. 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 Um, we have, we don't have red, but we have, um, actually, <laughs> we have a berry metallic, don't we? We have a red. That's not. That looks like kind of clay, though. Where's Alan's murderette? Oh, yeah. Right yeah, but that's not a metallic. That's a shimmer. That's a shimmer. Yeah. There's a difference between metallics and shimmer. Brian said you had half the canvas. <laughs> Cut it right there. Yeah, Linda, I'm like addicted to sweet tea. So when he went to the store, I said, well, you can pick me up a, a jug, so I'll have it for the week. So he brings me home slightly sweet tea. That's all they had. <laughs> I know. You already told me that, but I'm just telling them. I thought it was funny. Uh, Somebody is tweeting. Yeah. It's a little... Traded up 1.23% today at 300. I don't need stock info. You don't care about apple. Right, it's not the same when you add sugar when it's cold. You kind of have to have the syrup. I mean, I can make the syrup. We did it at the bakery all the time. It is. It's like drinking straight up syrup. McDonald's tea. It's super, super sweet. That's probably why I bounce off walls. That's not why you bounce off walls. Why do I bounce off walls? Because you like chasing me around the house. No, I don't. I don't chase anybody anymore. I see pinks there. You see pinks. Yeah. That, that's good. Um, I can get it. Shall? So, for those of you that asked for Maria's link to her cabins, I'm just posting it. 
if you want peace and quiet. Oh my goodness, yes. Now the one thing that we didn't do is we didn't do a lot of sightseeing. No, I'm not, I'm not a sightseeing person. When I go on vacation, I want it to be a restful vacation. You know, like hang out for what you're paying for, hang out there. <laughs> Got to feed the squirrels. I just posted your retreat. Or yeah, your retreat. It was a retreat for me. Your cabin resort link, Maria. Sorry, getting in my toy box. She couldn't get me to leave. She tried. She kept sending me these places to go. Why don't you and Alan go here? Why don't you and Alan go there? I'm like, no, I'm staying here. I needed that. Downtown. What was, I mean, we had our laptops with us and, but I, I wasn't really like checking emails. It wasn't like I was working, working, but I still kind of worked. It's just a nice getaway. Yeah. I was surprised how well you traveled. Yeah, because usually I get car sick. Because for us, that was about 1,100 miles drive. I think it was all the dancing I did in the car. Is that what? <laughs> all the trip, all the tea you drank on the way there. <laughs> but we really had, I mean... Oh, Susan, I didn't even bring half the studio. I brought about a 24th of it. <laughs> you would love that, then, Linda, because that's exactly what it is. I spent probably most of my day on the back deck um, when we weren't cooking or sleeping because we went to bed early and got up late. And Except for that one night. Yeah. Yes, this is Payne's Gray mixed with a little gunmetal metallic. Oh, if you guys would have seen me chair boogie and you'd be laughing your butts off because, you know, I, I do my best to sing off key to drive him crazy. I get to this one. The sprinkler or whatever they call it. Oh, it was fun. But we got to see my sister. Christine yeah. had never met I've her never before. Met her. I hadn't seen her in 20 some years. She lives in northeastern Arkansas. And then we went, spent the night there. They came out Sunday to see us, her and her husband and their youngest. Dylan, he's so cute. And we spent, and Monica joined us. Yeah, Monica, Monica came Saturday and she stayed till Monday morning. Monica Strickland. But we were so disappointed that our bloom stuff didn't work because we were all excited to do blooms. We sat there all night Saturday mixing all those bases up and they just didn't work because we had to use a different kind of paint. Did you ever figure out? Yeah, it was definitely the base. Base? Yeah. I checked it when we got home. And then when we left, we left Saturday morning. We met up with Carrie and her husband, Steve. That was fun. She was so excited. I know. She was like <laughs> a little kid at Christmas. <laughs> Okay, color choices. I know everybody's going to say, wow, wow, what kind of colors are you using here? But Pinks always look great on paints, gray. Master Touch Pink. Is that neon pink? Neon pink, sorry. Color Shifts Orchid Flash. Folk Art Purple Flash.
not black, Brian. It's Payne's gray. Deco art, 24 karat gold. It's a 9 by 11 canvas, too, Brian. <laughs> Master Touch Neon Pink. And Master Touch Neon Purple. Ooh. We did spoil you, Maria. <laughs> no, we didn't. She loved having dinner ready every night when she got home. <laughs> yeah, I had fun. She'd come in, what, 5 36 o'clock after checking her emails? Honey, I'm home. <laughs> So I spray my cup with the WD-40. I'm going to start off with the Color Shift Orchid Flash. Now the key thing here is not to use a lot of paint. That's going to be hard for me. Or he wants to know where's the green. <laughs> is that your house, Bri? We should send him all of our green paint. Because we have like, what, 20 some different greens up there? <laughs> we got enough. Oh, yeah, Shell, the Instapot, for sure. My son uses it more than I do. He was out here today looking in the freezer for chicken tenders. Ooh. Christopher. Because he wanted to make his burrito bowl. Can we give that just a little swirl? I like that neon purple in there. It's pretty. Flip and drag. I'm trying to think, do I want to go offside? Yeah, let's go in the center. Both seals are not cheap. They're like two for 30 bucks or something, 40 bucks. What seals? on the instant pot. I'm just gonna poke holes, try to do a little suction. And let's see what we can do here. Oh, that's pretty. I needed to see you go through it because it was so pretty. Mm. It's almost cheaper to buy a new one. Says it looks like a galaxy portal. And your gold even showed up. That's pretty. Oh, and there's the moon. <laughs> I got a little. I need to pull some of this paint. Be careful.
Tammy, I got your email, hon. The um, summer colors are, I think there's one, two, two metallics, two shimmers. I was thinking about doing all flip and drags for the month of June. I love that. You have to tell that. <laughs> yeah, I would too. take a skewer and maybe like pull some squigglies out or something and just, I love it. I wouldn't. Um, Mess with it too much. I got a couple dead spots where I dragged the cup against the can. I can see that one. Pick up some off your pad and fill it. <laughs> You're funny, Bri. <laughs> Wants to know when my Starburst month is coming up. <laughs> That's what May of two thousand twenty one. I know it's tough to if you wanna like blow out your edges or squiggle some color out. I would like to see how much it moves when you tilt it though, just a little bit, because you may have to take some of that down. Although you didn't add a lot. 348 days, Bri. Is that our retreat, Bri? Another dead spot. Right? Yeah. I still have, um, I know I have definitely one king room left for the retreat. If anybody's interested in signing up for that room, just send me an email. Um, that trip is May 15th through the 22nd at the Outer Banks next year. Uh, three days of painting. And then the rest is for you to go and enjoy the sights and restaurants and You don't think I should move anything, huh? Well, you can. I would try to stretch a little bit just so I can see how much paint of yours is moving. Go towards um, towards your cup. Cause you have a little bit there in the middle that I can yep. see. Um, bring it towards you. There you go. Well, you're going. You're fine. Just what you were doing before. Yeah, Beth, that's why we decided um, we were going to paint Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. And maybe Wednesday morning, but um, that's even pushing it. That way everybody that's driving in can take their paintings home. And those that aren't, I'll bring here. And then I can ship them to them. Yeah, don't let that fall over the edge, babe. All right, you're going to get wonky. I'd stop. See how it's zigzagging a little bit? You're good. That's good. You could add some interest with a skewer if you want to pull some of those lines out. I like what's going on. Like on the outskirts. It's a very faint. I'm not doing anything to it. I'm going to torch it one more time. 
Um, Christy, for lacing, it's definitely um, the weight of the paint and how you layer your cup. But to get the little round cells, and Alan can show you what are cells. Let me point those out for her. Mm -hmm. um, that's created with the treadmill silicone. So when you go to varnish these paintings, you have to clean them to get that silicone off. That's why a lot of girls don't use um, silicone. They can get cells with just their Floetrol. But um, it's not, hard, it's, I mean, it's not hard to clean them. Lift it up, honey, so she can see them up close. I mean, I don't have trouble getting the silicone off at all. Sorry about the glare, guys. So these little, let me see if I can point it out to her. Get your finger. These little things here are cells. Like here. Because it, this stuff here is not so much created with the silicone, but it's more created with the paint densities. And that's what makes it um, bleed into the other colors. Now, when that dries, that purple flash is going to be, depending on the angle you're looking at, it's going to be... And you have the orchid flash in there, too. It's going to be a different color. I th it's be Well, the thing with me is I've always used silicone, so I'm so used to cleaning it off that it doesn't bother me. But there are some times when I do a painting, I'm like, ugh, it's just way too many cells. So you don't have to put it in every color. You can just put it in one or two colors. The one thing about paints gray is the edges. You touch them. So, Christy, if you're looking for lacing, you definitely want to have white or black in the bottom of your cup because that's going to force its way down through the other colors to try to sink to the canvas, and that's what's going to create the lacing. I like that. Off to the drying rack. You wiped your edges because yep. they look like they're dripping from here. Yep, I wiped them. So Linda wants to know why you saved the bug. I just never picked them up off the floor. <laughs> See what I go through, you guys? <laughs> now, he told me he was there two days ago, so that's how long he's been sitting there. <laughs> I didn't go check him out when he told me he was there, so I didn't know where he was at. <laughs> Look at those skins. <laughs> yeah. I think you should pull tiles. No, I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> okay. So that's the third masterpiece tonight. Oh, are what we? are you going to do for the Finale. I don't know. Mike showed up. Hi, Mike. <laughs> meow, meow. All isn't, right. Isn't it time for Mike to get his delivery? Oh, another kitten in box. Okay, let's see. Mikey. Linda Brown says, how about a ribbon pour? 
dirty Jeez. ribbon. I can do a dirty ribbon. Um. Now I think you. I think you should do a flip and drag also. What you want me to show you up? Uh, you're gonna have a hard time doing it. Oh, that that sounds like a challenge. <laughs> Brian says, you looked around, Alan. You walked walk right into that one there, Jets. Oh, sure. So my canvas is a little bit bigger than yours. Wow. So you want me to use Payne's Gray, too? Is that the whole... Fine. Oh, okay. So there's no rules. No rules. All right. I'm going to use up this Brian way. says, how about a 12 by 24? I don't think I have one. That's prepped. Prep. They're way up on the top rack, right? Hello, Lorena and the shots are calling for boiler makers. Yeah, we'll we'll see, Shelly. Yeah, I'm gonna show the pup how it's done. I like Linda's little comment there. He does pretty well for a beginner though. For a pup? For a pup. Speaking of pups, still no video. I need to call her. Yeah, I know I'm going to start whining like a puppy pretty soon if I don't see the puppies. It's <clears throat> on. It's on like Donkey Kong. Why do you do things like that? <laughs> and I told you, every time you do that, I was going to point it out to you, and I did, didn't I? He's got a bad habit of leaving his dirty paper towels in my painting area. Could be worse. <laughs> the face that, yeah, that sweet, innocent face isn't sweet and innocent anymore. We have been um, having a lot of fun lately. I, since our trip, because we just found out that we really, we kind of found ourselves again, like our sense of humor, and we had such a great time that we needed that. We've never been on a vacation by ourselves, so we've always either had the kids or we were with other people, so it was fun to get away without anybody with us. So I'm going to take off as much as I can because you don't want it soaking wet. <laughs> Are you pregnant? No. God, no. <laughs> Shh. Oh, Linda. That plumbing's been rerouted. <sighs> that exit has been closed. Linda says she hasn't seen her man for 36 days. He's been in the hospital. I've been praying I'm for so him sorry. every day. Okay. Colors. I'm going to let Alan pick my colors. I need to choose your colors. Why not? Let's because see if I can make them work. Once you lose, you blame it on the colors. Oh, I chose. that's true. I so. probably would. <laughs> you know better than that. <laughs> Carrie's okay. like red. Remember, Carrie, red, red and white gives me pink. Red and black are very hard to do on a canvas. I've done it once, and that's a very popular video on my channel. I have not done it again since. Okay. Linda will be praying for him. Yep, we haven't stopped. So let's put some gold brand in there because we got to have some highlight. Let's use the, actually, let's use the beach retreat shimmer. Oh, I already used it. You did? My first one. Oh, and not on your flip and drag. Go away. 
And we'll use the darker ocean teal. But I need one more color. Green. You could do dragonfly. Dragon. Or we could do... Uh, Brian's annoying green. No, I don't want that green. Because it is, it's annoying. Let me put it, um, I'm going to put a little square of interference green in there, though. But I'm not, we're not going to see that until it's dry. Reason. No green. What about the lemon lime? Green has been quarantined. Or what about the coral reef? Chrissy says, how about a pink? Um, you used purple red, didn't you? I did. I don't think pink with that teal would be very pretty. Because we'll have mud. So Linda was saying, how about gold instead of bronze? I can do that. I can switch that out. I don't care if you used gold. Sue what are Jansen, you special or something? I am. Uh, Sue Jansen says lemon lime. I'm and thinking lemon lime would look really good with that. Joyce Davis says burgundy. The chat says copper. Yeah, copper looks good with blue. The teals too. Mary Ellen, we're hoping no. We'll be praying no no more surgeries. Okay, so let's do a shot of lemon lime and we'll do a, a little bit of copper in between those two teals. So we're using a lot of color. So five ounce cup, Ellen, I think you used a three, didn't you? Mm -hmm. You got bigger canvas. Though. Yeah. I need more spread room. Gave it a shot of my WD-40. Definitely going to rub that one in. Brian's like, wait, what did you say about my green? <laughs> I was trying to get her to use it. I'm using lemon lime. It's close enough. Okay. Christy Klein wants to know, how do you know what's going to make muddy yuck? So if you look at a color wheel, the color directly across is what's going to give you mud. So if you layer them properly, you can still use those two colors, but you have to layer something in between them. So I want the copper in the bottom because I don't want to lose that. On top. That way it comes up on the top. And then we'll do the beach retreat shimmer. And I'm going to use the interference green here. So we won't really see it. It's going to show up white, but we'll see it when it's dry. Then we'll do the ocean teal blue. And then the 24 karat gold. Because Alan told me I could use it. <laughs> so now, so now with the lemon lime, instead of just putting it on the top, I'm going to squirt it down the middle too. It went off to the side, didn't it? It went down. What are you, the paint police now? <laughs> now you got some red on your canvas up there. That's from mixing paint the other night. <laughs> Jake already pointed that out to me. All right, I'm going to give it just a little bit, just an X. Okay, interesting color in there. So we'll wait for that to drop. It's already releasing. The gauntlet has been laid down. Who said that? You? I did. Oh. Shelly says, I think we need a tutorial on color, Christina. 
Yeah, I know. I think it would be a help to many. I always said I was going to do that because Nate did one and he's like, now it's your turn. <laughs> Linda says, what was after the interference? The other teal, the ocean teal. If I remember correctly. Everybody's agreeing with Shelly. Linda and Sue. Okay, I'm poking two holes. So when you're doing a flip and drag, remember to get those that suction release. You want that cup to float on the top so you don't have to scrape your canvas. Thank you, Carrie. Thank you, Carrie. I appreciate you. Carrie, I'm going to send you a picture of a haircut, and you're going to tell me if I can do that with my hair or not. Since you know what my hair looks like now. All right, let's torch it. i got a ton of cells. Yes, a color matching tutorial would be great. All right, let's see. Let's stretch it out a little bit. I'm not like Alan. I like to move mine around. I got to take a little off that edge. You said, okay, sounds good. I've been, I have it. It's either on my phone or on my computer. I haven't been able to find it. I may have to go back online and look for it again. So everybody that's here watching this little challenge is going to have to be back next Monday to make the final judgment. What spot there I don't like? Brian. See, you need the airbrush. Alan didn't need an airbrush. <laughs> neener, neener, neener. You know why, Brian? Can I tell you why I don't need why I need an airbrush and Alan doesn't? Because Alan uses too much paint. Brian. <laughs> so he can drop his cup and have enough paint on the canvas. He used a lot more paint than I did. Brian. <laughs> Troublemaker. Instigator. Kind of annoying, isn't it? Yeah, he's kind of annoying. That's why he has his own paint color. I'm just kidding. Brian, you know I'm I love you. <laughs> Blasphemy. All right, I'm gonna torch one more time and I am gonna blow some of it out. Do I straw? No. <gasps> Where's my hairbrush? <laughs> it's still backed, isn't it? in that box right there. No. I don't think so. Ah. It's still packed. I think I know where it is. Run, Forrest, run. I don't think it's over there because I took care of all that stuff today. Where's the little satchel baggie thing? The white bag? Yeah. On the floor over here. That's where I think it is. Shelly's like straw. Brian says. It's pretty bad we haven't unpacked everything yet. Ha ha. Get a straw. Go old school. I don't like loops. I don't like loopies. So Jen says baster. I'm going to be spitting. All right. So now that I have it out here, for all of you that wonder about our airbrush, it's just a little compressor with the air gun attachment. Blows about 25 PSI. I have it in my Amazon shop if anybody's interested. You could have used the leaf blower. I could have used your little one, yeah. 
Except there's no place to plug it in. Oh, because the plug is... <laughs> we need to get our crap together, don't we? <laughs> we still haven't unpacked anything. All right, here we go. Let's get to work. I say that a lot. Let's get to work. I'm just pushing out the edges. Give it some interest. So, yeah, I went back and I was looking at some of my old videos the other day because I was bored, which is rare. And I was like, wow, I used to push out everything. I don't do that anymore. So it's, it's fun to watch yourself develop as an artist. Like stuff that you're doing now in two years, you'd be like, ugh, I can't believe I used to do that. So it's, you're always learning something new. Well, I spent a little time on Jerry's Artorama today. I was, I was a good girl. Yeah, right. I only got what I had to get. That's not the website you need to be afraid of. <laughs> Which one is that? What? That you need to be afraid of? Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby. Especially when my canvases are in stock. I do buy a lot off Amazon too, though. Terry says she uses her luminous make air blow blower. Yep. The makeup airbrush. Then they have the cake decorating airbrush. It's the same thing. 25 PSI. Sometimes you can get those on clearance. The Cake Boss has his stuff on clearance. So I love this dark thing here. I'm going to push it all the way out. I'm going to try to hook it. I'm going to play off that one. Yes, Alan's was much prettier. But we'll see what they look like when they're dry. <laughs> Terry says the makeup brush doesn't work for makeup, but it does work for paint. <laughs> yep. You know, as long as your base paint is thin enough, it should be able to push it with a low PSI. Because you definitely don't want to go in and like blow it all out. So it's flying off your canvas. I've seen a lot of people do that on their channel when they get a new airbrush and I kind of giggle, but I did it too. <laughs> they had Cake Boss at Dollar Tree. I'm just going to pull that back a smidge so it doesn't run over. Michelle says she loves the colors, but I'm partial to Alan's. Yes, yeah, because Alan's is galaxy looking. His is dramatic. Just like me. You guys can quit playing favorites now. <laughs> Nobody ever picks me. I'm just kidding. Carrie says she can airbrush other people's makeup, but just not her own. Well, the problem is, Carrie, you probably have paint on your airbrush. <laughs> Carrie doesn't need makeup. She's beautiful. She is. So, I like that little dark spot. No, we can't. We're not judging tonight now, Joyce. Next week when they're dry. Because that's how we'll be able to tell for sure what they look like. Oh, can you move those cups? So don't leave yet, guys. get this picked up by the way Carrie I like your art room I love her art room too 
I love all her artwork in her house. Oh my gosh. <laughs> How many people we got here tonight? 68. 68 lucky people. Okay, guys, I'm going to do a giveaway. What? Yep. Summer collection in jars. Now, when you mix these, they have to be mixed with Floetrol first if you're using glue. Because the glue will make glop with the metallic. So make sure you use the Floetrol first and then you can add glue and then more Floetrol. Don't use water. You don't need water. Ryan says, why would we leave you? You got two more paintings to do. No, I don't. He's mean tonight. Well, he must have been doing laundry or something. I got pinching couple. really hard. <laughs> Let me write a number down. Okay, okay, tell everybody the rules. Okay, so here's the rules. USA only, sorry. Um, it's going to be a number between 1 and 50. Please only guess once first and then... Should anybody refresh? You guys want to refresh first? Is everybody... Let's give you... We'll give you two minutes to refresh so that you're right on because we... Okay. Lorena, yes, you can use them just to paint with. It's paint. It's just the pigment, right? It's paint. Paint. So look anybody that needed to go out and come back in, look how pretty. Alcohol does the same thing. Somebody needs to do your airbrush now. Hmm? Somebody needs to do your airbrush now. I usually do it once a month. Yeah, don't start yet, guys, because we're letting everybody refresh. And the reason we're doing that is sometimes we have people that are lagging. Mm -hmm. We want to be as fair as possible. I'm going to type it in in case somebody's lagging really bad. Sixty. Still got a couple going out, coming back in. Oh, yeah, they go. There they go. Linux. So we were lagging. Some, some of you were lagging because all of you kind of faded out there for a second. Well, there's a couple new people, I think, in here, too. So explain the rules. So I'm getting to it. I'm going to wait for everybody to get back in. Okay. What if they're out? I don't want to rush you. Are you using alcohol or are you just using a baby wipe? Just a baby wipe. You put alcohol in there, it comes right off. I do that with the torch too. Well, that torch has seen better days. <clears throat> 57. Did we actually lose that many people? 11 people don't want to win paint? <laughs> yeah, Christy, that's exactly what we meant. Okay, it's coming back up now, guys. It depends what um, what they're on, too. If they're on a tablet or on their TV set or... <laughs> Can I get in my... What? Fire? No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I use alcohol to clean everything. It takes the paint right off. I got 59, Maria. Oh, now I got 62. All right, I think we're good because it goes down and then comes back up. All right, so if you've been here before, you know how we do the giveaways. Do not put a number up yet. <laughs> fire, fire. Okay, so what I'm going to need from you if you win 
I need you to email me your mailing address and you'll be mailing that to Christina Welch Art at yahoo.com. If you've purchased something from me in the past, like paint or auction paintings, I probably have your address in PayPal. So no worries there. So for this giveaway, number between 1 and 50, and I'll type in when you can go. So get your number in your head and ready to go. And go. It's so nice when it goes slow, isn't it? <laughs> there it yep, is. There it is. Melody. Melody Gable is our winner. Congratulations, Melody. And I probably have her info. So we can write stop. We have a winner. How look at it go through? Yeah. So Mel, I will send these out to you. If you want to just throw me a quick email, that's fine too, but I think I have your address. <laughs> So congrats. Thanks guys for joining us tonight. I hope everyone stays safe. Um, life can be a, you know what, sometimes and- A beach. Yep, we just have to take it and go with it. And with no retreat. With no retreat, exactly. <laughs> that was a good one, Al. I'm clever. <laughs> So thanks so much for joining us tonight, and we'll be back next Monday Night Live. I'm not sure how many videos I'll get up this week. I'm really trying to uh, get caught up out here, but I'll try to get three up, but I'm not sure. And remember, you got to join us next week because the gauntlet has been laid down. Yeah. Thank you, Deborah. I appreciate you. Thanks, everyone, for your donations. Um, if you've sent them through PayPal to our email, I appreciate that very much. And uh, we'll see you all next Monday night. Have a good evening. Bye now.